Right now is Hurricane Irma technically at its weakest. It made its way all the way up to Virginia as potentially, depending on how you interpret it, a category one storm, which is a very weak storm. Oh, did you hear that? That's that's the storm right there. Um, let's take a look at it. And I'm gonna do some chin-ups and stuff. We're watching, we're watching the storm. was 21 chin-ups and that was the storm Hurricane Irma the tail end of it it's not going to hurt anyone like a little chihuahua wagging his little tail it's not hurting anyone unfortunately on September 11th the storm calmed down I'm gonna see how many curls I can do with 45 pound dumbbells while you're watching some more footage of the storm. See how see if I can break a record on this after I did just did 21 chin-ups. Yeah.
Hey, how's it going? That was 88 curls of 45 pound dumbbells. And the reason why I may have been swinging in quotes a little bit is because they actually did that in pumping iron, Arnold Schwarzenegger's first major motion picture documentary that was before Conan the Barbarian. If you watch them training in that, they kind of swing a little bit. It's a full body exercise somewhat. You don't just isolate each muscle every single um, uh, rep and every single set. So that's why I may have somewhat used the rest of my body to complete the curls. However, I did it in perfect form by many standards if you were to study the aesthetics of bodybuilding. Okay, thanks. And the motives behind the aesthetics, obviously, and the health and fitness, you know, as I have for 20 years. All right, trying to help you to get healthy and give you tips here and there. You know, don't overdo it. Start small, start light, get heavier. You can overcome all sorts of physical ailments through health and fitness, and um, it's pretty amazing. And um, it's pretty unparalleled what you can do to reverse what you believe in your mind could be a, a, a permanent problem which may not even be in many cases or you can at least better it through health and fitness so the mind is directly connected to the body and once you get your mind and body healthy then um, or once you make attempts at that and you're motivated to get there beyond anything you can do almost anything and Here's the rest of the footage of the storm. I'm going to continue exercising. All right. Okay. Just finished those. Still out of breath from doing the... Uh... <sighs> 21 chin-ups. 70-something... 70 something curls with 45 pounds. Now I'm going into this. I'm getting in shape and you should too if you want to be healthy in the mind and the body it's true okay subscribe bye and like so it'll be all right and don't eat something fried tonight eat something healthy if you can if you want to get buff like me I'm a big strong man okay later hey how's it going everybody this video is to say that as cool as, as I was trying to act in that in those pictures and that video and getting super awesome shape and all this stuff that is not the most important thing family loved ones and friends that are close that you care about in general people are more important than your own selfish um ideas of success and what you want to be your ideology of what makes you the happiest beyond anything because that's just very selfish so if you can balance what you like that makes you the happiest which is very unbelievably important I shouldn't have undermined it so much and also be kind to others that you love like for example my family and friends I would say that my children and like finding a soulmate um, again or having one that I already know want to marry me or be with me for a long time that's that's more important than anything else that's that 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 doesn't matter as much and doesn't have to do as much with love and stuff like that so um, Try not to be as selfish as I was in this video. Family is way more important than trying to look cool and, 
and, and, and go after stupid things that you want. Family is way more important. So try to be kind to them and then they'll be kind to you. Okay, bye.